Hey guys, so with the holiday season coming up in less than a few weeks' time, anxiety, I think, for youths, you know, between the ages of 14 and 25, are affected by this. You know what I mean? It affects them socially, mentally, physically. It just alters your perspective, especially with the added pressures of going to parties, family commitments, Christmas, New Year. All this is being jammed into one. And for me personally, I actually had the same sort of thing. I found out that I had to have uh, surgery a week before Christmas. And when I first found out, I was so pissed off, to be honest. I was just so angry, and I couldn't cope, and I didn't know what to do, and it was making me feel anxious about the future, of what's going to happen to me. And I think for a number of people, for everybody, basically, they have their own way of coping with anxiety. And I think that's the main thing that you need to focus on, that there's always going to be a certain way that you can do it. And that's what I did. I asked some individuals and asked them, you know, how do you deal with anxiety during the holiday period? Whenever I feel anxious or, like, sad or depressed or anything, I try and just read a book or something. I deal with anxiety by, I don't know, listening to music, just calming down, relaxing. A few might argue that it's bad to like, not face the problem head on, but a lot of time it's good to just let time like, take its course and, and just see like, where, the, um, where everything leads. Usually when I'm anxious, I do something that involves a lot of movement, like taking a walk or, I don't know, just something, just because usually, just something to, to, to get my mind off it, because when I get my mind off it, usually it stops, so it stops from being anxious, because the less I think about it, I calm myself down by distracting myself with things like music, games, MSN, friends, family, internet, TV. <laughs> so basically the way I deal with stress and anxiety over the holidays is just, I just listen to music way more than usual and, um, well, PC games. Um, I don't know, sometimes dancing, I don't know, just feel the beat of the music and just calm down. Yeah. With anxiety, your family is probably the best, best way to go. Just talk to your family or your friends. The people that love you, it's always the way to go. It's true, you know. By distracting yourself and putting your thoughts and main focus on something that's not associated with the problem really helps. Come back to it later after you've, you know, gotten really into something and then come back, look at it from a clearer perspective because it's going to really help. And also, talking to a family member or a trusted friend or someone you trust about the problem also helps because if you bottle it up, it can really get to you and then you can explode and say the wrong thing to the wrong person and that can also ruin the holidays for you in so many ways possible. And that's sort of the main thing I'm sort of trying to, you know, get out there. You know, talk to someone. If you see someone who's suffering from anxiety or you think is, talk to them. Ask them, if, are you okay? Sort of try and get it out of them if you know something's different with them because anxiety can affect people on a lot of different levels and it's not good to have. It's not, it's not a good thing to go through, especially during the holiday period. So, yeah, have a good, you know, have a good holiday. Stay safe. And remember, you're not alone. Talk to someone. Thanks, guys. Head to au.reachout.com for more information, fact sheets, and personal stories.